For National Read a Book Day this weekend, we decided to look at book pages with the Phenom XL Scanning Electron Microscope. We also used EDS, a technique used with SEMs to identify which elements are present in the sample and how they are distributed. This book was printed in 1927 with carbon black ink, which was the standard at the time. The EDS map of the ink showed concentrated iron and sulfur, which came from additives that helped ink dry more quickly and evenly, improving print quality. In this book, printed in 2008, EDS identified the white specks as carbonate fillers, still common today in machine-made paper for improving brightness, opacity, and print quality. The fibers are wood pulp and the pores are typical of hardwood fibers. This book was printed in 1794 with iron gall ink on paper made from cotton and linen rags. Many of the white specks were identified as calcium sulfate crystals, likely formed when calcium in the paper reacted with sulfur from the chemicals applied to prevent the ink from bleeding. Several spot analyses show a blend of lead, antimony, and tin, which makes sense because movable type and printing presses was made from an alloy of those metals. Tiny pieces of metal may have chipped off from the type during printing. Today we only imaged black ink, but what elements might be present in colored inks? Let us know in the comments. Follow us on LinkedIn and YouTube for more videos.